Um, six Handball, you know, is initiated here for the first time, and today is launching. Um, I would like to say I'm a very happy man today. Um, this event is brought here in collaboration with Gambia Handball Association. Um, Laudaba, who is the project coordinator of Street Handball Gambia. Earlier this evening, uh, he sent us an update on the progress of the game from his base in Tujere. He first began with a brief description of the game Street Handball. Street Handball is an outdoor game played on our streets, at school grounds, marketplace, or any other open place you think can accommodate two goalposts and some audience who come to cheer the game. We thought it wise to take street handball seriously on our streets, you know, to inspire those outside there who cannot make their way to the handball arenas in one way or the other to watch handball games. We deem it wise to send it to the streets, also to inspire the kids, you know, who never knew about handball before, um, to inspire them, this and many more. And Six Handball Gambia is a sister, rep sister project to Six Handball uh, International with the headquarters in Denmark. And the founder is uh, Soren Goldberg uh, since 2006, Denmark. And now we have Street Handball in Japan, Street Handball in Indonesia, and now Street Handball in the Gambia, uh, which I am the project manager. The game was launched in the Gambia back in 2019 at Batakungu Settlement, located in Combo South District, West Coast Region, the Gambia, um, in collaboration with the Gambia Handball Association and Warriors Handball Club. You know, if you if you could follow our Facebook page some times ago, you could see some pictures of some of our handball players, national handball players, you know, who travel to the South Gambia settlement of Pata Kunku to exhibit the game to the villagers. So since then, we've been organizing a series of uh, street handball events. The recent one was at Fandema Institute in Tijeren, or Molo Association, uh, their 2019 cultural festival. So street handball was among hosts of events they introduced this year. So we are there on Friday, 28th December, which was the fourth day of the event. It was the fourth day of the festival between the hours of 10 a.m. to 12 midday. You know, we are there where we gave first-hand information about street handball to fund them as students. You know, over 50 students benefited the event, including their teachers, because at the end of the game, the end of the exhibition, you know, there was a match between uh, teachers and their students, which the students um, claimed, you know, so it was, it was a fun day. Well, sir, you to add more about the recent street handball event we held at Fandema Ombolo Association Institute in Tujeren. On street handball, we definitely attracted the entire student in the school, and of course, to all the students who turn out in their large numbers, you know, from the satellite environment to grace the occasion, you know. So at the end of the game, we made some assessment to find out how or what the students have to say about the game. Some of them we are saying it was fun, it was loving, you know, we keep them fit, now they know how to throw the ball. Now, they have basic information about handball. When they go back, they will explain it to their parents to give them more courage to play the game, which was definitely um, a pleasant feedback we expect from them, you know. So I would like to say a big thank you to, you know, the host, Fandema, you know, um, head by Mr. Marlon Sambu and Mrs. Sylvia. I would like to, you know, express my sincere gratitude to them, you know, for always opening their doors when I need a place. They definitely, they, they really so a brotherhood. You know, I would like to tell you that um, we received some Street Handball gifts, Christmas gifts from Street Handball International. Uh, we received a suitcase which includes street handball t-shirts, street handballs. You have over 20 street handballs, you know, some cones, you know, this and some other uh, materials, you know. Um, so I'm definitely very impressed about that. In conclusion, I will say thank you very much, Sergio, for granting me yet another interview speaking to West Coast Radio. And whoever want to know more about street handball or want to play street handball, do not hesitate to book us. If you want to know more about the game, you can better still visit our Facebook page, Street Handball Gambia or Street Handball International, to, more, to know more about the game.
Taudaba, project coordinator, Street Handball Gambia, speaking to us from his base in Tujeren. He was speaking there about a new form of handball called the Street Handball that is now all over Combo South.